So let's go ahead and understand the difference between a trinomial, a binomial, and a monomial. Once we explain this, I think it'll be a lot easier for you to understand. But a trinomial is just like a tricycle. A tricycle has three wheels, and a trinomial has three terms. So anything that's separated by an addition or a subtraction sign is going to be represented as a term. So let's just say we went ahead and did 3y squared minus 5y plus 2. That's what you call a trinomial because there's one term that's 3y squared, there's another term that's 5y, and there's another term that's just 2 and you can tell they are separated by an addition or a subtraction sign. So the same would be the case for a binomial. A bi or bi means two, so two terms. So you don't have to pay attention to the coefficient or what we call the number in front of the variable. You just look at that as a whole term. So 2x squared would be one whole term, just like 5 would be one whole term. The only thing that separates a term is an addition or a subtraction sign. So here, 5y plus 2 would be a binomial since there's only two terms. Another example would be x minus 9. Why? Because x is a term and then a 9 is separated by a subtraction sign, so it's 9. A monomial means there's actually nothing there, just the number or the variable. So it's just one term. Mon means one, so monomial is one term. 2 is a great example. We could do 2x cubed. That's another example. We could do 5. We could do negative 4. Anything that's just by itself as one term is a monomial. So remember, trinomial is 3, binomial is 2, and monomial is 1.